is Taylor Rowe. How do you stop a freight train? You don't stop it. You step aside. Look at the big fellow. Oh, you can run him at the great wall and he would go straight through it. Dave Taylor dives over. Well, that's freaky. That's a fluke. How ironic. On his day, there was no better player. But, you know, you didn't, didn't know what you are going to get. Yeah, he, had, he had all the skills. Of it. I think he wanted to be a halfback. He had the skill sets of a halfback, which was awesome. I'd never forget John Lang and I were at Dave Taylor's wedding, which was in his backyard at Cronulla, and uh, his mum and dad were there. And we'd had a few beers later in the day, and his dad came wandering over and said to John Lang, when are you going to play Dave at 5'8"? And John Lang turned to him and said, when hell freezes over. Probably the most talented forward I've seen. You know, he, he, he was a uh, halfback in a forward's body, Dave. But sometimes Dave, uh, you know, let all those little halfback type skills, um, uh, you know, dominate when maybe he should have just been running hard. I'll never forget, I'm sitting next to John Lang and, and all that week John Lang had said to me in the dressing room, don't kick the ball. Whatever you do, don't kick the ball. So he goes on the left-hand side, of the goes through, kicks the ball, and Lang goes, I screamed, I haven't told him not to kick the ball. And the next minute he scored from the kick. He's tackled immediately. It was a good tackle, Brad Ty. Here's Taylor rolling the ball in. Don't end. He's after it. He might have got it down. Oh, he yeah. thinks he did. Oh, Billy oh, Slater, Ben Barber, he just oh, the ball. But Taylor's still here. The ability of, of a man that, you know, a back row, a front row, to be able to do that was unbelievable. Um, probably the most naturally talented forward I've ever seen in my whole life. Finds Reynolds with a grab and kick, classy, and Taylor is in. Brilliant start for the South Sydney Rabbitohs. Probably the, the biggest bloke that I've seen with so much talent. The chip and chase and, and pull it off and um, flick pass, throw cutout passes, kick 40-20s, you name it, the big man can do it. Massive human, I just couldn't believe someone could be that big and move that well and have good ball skills too. I was doing work experience with the club and um, the one job I had was I had to run out um, his nasal spray. So I, I don't know why, he always had to have a nasal spray so when they were training he'd call me across, I'd sprint across, give him nasal spray, spit out snot and then go again. You can't stop the bulldozer from that close to the line. It wouldn't matter if it was a brick wall. But when he, when he did come on the charge, I mean, it's like a steam pump. You know, it, it, you know, it was all, it all, it all ends on board for the opposition. He just, one bloke couldn't bring him down. You need, you know, you need about three or four. And try and stop the Rabbitohs. It goes down to Sutton. He gets it to Taylor, who brings it back and gives it to McQueen. They're away. He knew what he was doing. He knew they were going to come at him, and he knew he could draw and put Chris McKean away. He, he was that smart. He, that wasn't some fluke. Yeah, I just sort of uh, run as hard as I could and try and uh, get a quick play of the ball. Hope we can work with that. And um, I realised there's no winger out there, and we had two players, so uh, the smartest thing to do was pass it. Definitely a talented player that um, had all the skill sets that I wish I had. A rip of a player and a uh, good bloke too. A lot, lot of fun to be around. <laughs> Blushes going through the hand.